Imagine sailing across the vast, unforgiving North Atlantic Ocean, where the wrath of the sea meets the fury of the skies. This was the everyday reality for a Viking explorer. But who were these intrepid adventurers? Often misunderstood as mere barbarians, the Vikings were in fact sophisticated navigators, traders, and settlers who left an indelible mark on the history of Europe and beyond. Today, we embark on a journey back in time to experience a day in the life of a Viking explorer. And perhaps, in their story, we'll discover something profound about the enduring human spirit. The day begins with the first light of dawn piercing through the dense fog that blankets the Viking settlement. Our explorer, let's call him Eric, rises from his bed, a simple structure made of wood covered with furs, in his longhouse. The air is thick with the smell of smoke from the central hearth, a comforting sign of life in the cold climate of Scandinavia. Eric's day starts with a meal, likely a porridge made from barley or rye, flavored with whatever meats or fruits were available. But there's little time for leisure. Eric is a man of the sea, and his heart lies beyond the horizon. The construction of his vessel, a nar or a longship, is a marvel of Viking innovation. Designed for both speed and cargo capacity, these ships were the pinnacle of medieval naval technology. With a shallow draft for navigating both open seas and rivers, the Viking longships were fearsome and versatile, facilitating raiding, exploration, and trade. Eric and his crew of skilled warriors and sailors gather their supplies for the journey. They load the ship with dried fish, meat, and cheese, enough to sustain them for weeks or even months at sea. They also bring along tools for building and repair, weapons for defense, and trade goods like furs, silver, and finely crafted jewelry. The ship cuts a striking figure as it sets sail, with its carved dragon head prow slicing through the waves, a symbol of protection and power. Once out on the open sea, the real test begins. Viking explorers relied on their profound understanding of the natural world to navigate. They observed the sun, the stars, and the color of the ocean. They used landmarks, birds, and ocean currents to guide them. The sagas tell us of sunstones, mysterious crystals that could locate the sun's position even on cloudy days. Life at sea was harsh and demanded every ounce of skill and courage. Storms could arise suddenly, threatening to send the ship and its crew to a watery grave. But the Vikings were not deterred by the challenges. They were driven by a desire for wealth, glory, and the promise of undiscovered lands. This drive led them to explore far beyond their native Scandinavia. They raided and traded across Europe, reaching as far south as the Mediterranean. They established settlements in Iceland and Greenland. And as the sagas tell us, Eric the Red and his son Leif Erikson even set foot in North America, centuries before Columbus. As the sun sets on our day with Eric, it's hard not to be moved by the Viking spirit. Theirs was a life of constant motion, of adaptation and exploration. The sea was both their greatest adversary and their pathway to the unknown. In many ways, the story of the Viking explorer is a reflection of the human condition a testament to our unyielding desire to discover, to conquer, and to understand the world around us. So next time you look out at the sea, imagine a Viking longship on the horizon, its sails full of wind, heading towards the unknown. It's a powerful reminder of where we've come from, and perhaps a hint at where we're headed. The Vikings were not just raiders or barbarians, they were pioneers of the human spirit. And in their saga, we find not only tales of adventure, but lessons about resilience, innovation, and the enduring quest for knowledge.